Good evening, everyone. Welcome to On the World Beat TV show with host and producer Helen Daphnes. I'm so delighted to be with you here today. I'm Deborah Vidala, the host of Plan for Fitness Talk Show. We're here on location in Delray Beach, Florida, and I have with me here Sharonda McGee. Welcome, Sharonda. Thank you very much. Ladies and gentlemen, Sharonda is um, a teacher, at, a professor at Palm Beach State College in Lake Worth, Florida. We're delighted to have you here today. I see firsthand, Sharonda, how dedicated you are with your students. As we did an event last night at the Pizza Palace with 25 students coming in, and it was a great party. They were there for a class assignment. Sharonda, tell the viewers what the assignment was last night for your class. Currently, I am teaching operations decision making, and the Pizza Palace was so gracious to host us, and Debbie was so wonderful to plan everything for us. Um, I wanted to provide them the first-hand experience of seeing what it really takes to own and operate a business. And they really enjoyed it. They will be providing me with a SWOT analysis of the operations, the strengths, weaknesses, opportunities, and threats. But I am more, more impressed with what Debbie does full-time. And, and, and she doesn't let her part-time Pizza Palace uh, deter her from servicing so many people within our community. So that's what I want to talk about. Thank you so much, Sharonda. I'm so delighted to have you with me today. And this is about help and education, folks. That's why we're here today spreading a message. Uh, please visit the website at planforfitnessradio.com to learn more about my services. I am a health and wellness trainer and a rehabilitation aid for the disabled. So today I'm here with Helen. We're, we're just so excited to be here in Delray Beach, Florida. Uh, please stay tuned. And we'll be right back after these messages. Welcome back, everybody, to Plan for Fitness Talk Show. I'm your host, Deborah Vidala, broadcasting in Delray Beach, Florida. I'm here with Helen Daphnes, host and producer of On the World Beat TV show. I'm delighted to be back here today. I'm talking with a professor at Palm Beach State College, and she had a wonderful class. We had a function at the Pizza Palace last night. And uh, the class is Operation Decision Making, which I was very intrigued about. Uh, and I wanted to ask you, Sharonda, the class assignment that you had last night for the students, what was the goal objective for this assignment? I really wanted to make the class practical. I wanted them to actually see what it takes to own and operate a business, not just from a book standpoint, but from a real standpoint, and what you brought to the table, because of who you are, is, and, 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 and you talk about healing people physically and, and, and um, bringing them back from, and rehabilitating, but you know that it's mental, you know that it's emotional, you know that it's spiritual, and everything at, from a community effort that you brought to make that happen. So that we have a third of our high school students not graduating. So the, the importance of education. So your organization is not just a physical thing. It's bringing it all together. So please, please tell them how you make that happen. Thank you so much, Sharonda. Thank you for recognizing how hard I work with Plan for Fitness Training and Rehabilitation. Again, I've had a client for many years. It's, we're coming on eight years. He's a diabetic neuropathy patient, uh, toe amputation. He was in a wheelchair. A very, very difficult and challenging client, and I get the job done. What can I say? It's just very, it's a passion. Uh, and you have to believe in what you do no matter what direction you go in. Ladies and gentlemen, that's the message for today. Do what you love. So I am very happy to have you with me here, Sharonda. You set a good example for the next generation. I saw in your class there was different age groups, but everybody was early. Uh, it was a good time. 
And uh, we certainly want to thank John, John and his family, the owner of the Pizza Palace on 1962 Lake Worth Road. Uh, Helen and I have been there for an event before, and we will be returning soon. So you will stay tuned for our next event there. Uh, just, just a real delight to have you with us. Yes. that in mind. It is an extension of what you do, the importance you have placed on healing people from every aspect. So please tell us once again your organization. Please. I love her. Sharonda knows that um, I have a, a, a great spiritual practice. Uh, everybody has an individual belief system. It's, it's uh, irrelevant. Do what makes you feel good and what helps you to be centered, uh, whether it's going every Sunday to Mass, whether it's reading meditation books, whether it's volunteering, getting out of yourself, collecting food for the hungry. Uh, Plan for Fitness is also involved. Um, always taking donations for um, the hungry and the, and the homeless. And you can certainly call me on the talk show line at area code 561 eight five six zero one hundred that's five six one eight five six zero one hundred I take donations all year long so thank you so much for tuning in today we'll be right back Great work. thank you Sharonda we'll be right back after these messages welcome back everybody to on the world beat TV show we're here filming on location in Delray Beach Florida I'm Deborah Vidala, the host of Plan for Fitness. Delighted to be back once again with Helen Daphnes. I want to give a special recognition to Jonathan Vidala. He shared his story with me. He's 29 years old and he is a veteran. Uh, it's an amazing story. Uh, he entered in the service at 18. Uh, he stayed till he's 23 and then went into to the reserves for one year. Ladies and gentlemen, he is the one that has been in Iraq fighting the war for all of us. So we certainly uh, just want to say thank you, Jonathan, for serving our country. Uh, we love you. And, and, and also, I, I wanted to talk about why I was so intrigued by Jonathan. He shared with me that his mother was in the Navy as well for 20 years. And that is a big deal. And what an example she has set for him. Um, again, the wheels are in motion for this young man. He's got his whole life ahead of him, and he's already just given such great service for all of us so we can be free in the USA. I also asked him, you know, what was the best thing that you got out of serving? And he said it was the best decision he ever made, uh, a positive experience, and, and he's blessed. He came home alive, unhurt. He has all his limbs. And that is really uh, something to be grateful for. Yes. Ladies and gentlemen, I have Sharonda McGee, a professor of Palm Beach State College with me. And she has a question for the host. Because it is so intriguing to me that your organization and your ministry um, provides healing for people of all ages. Mental, emotional, spiritual, physical. Tell me what you provide on a day-to-day -day basis and, and why we need to support you because we do. I know, but they need to know why we need to support you because all ages, people are suffering on all those levels, mental, emotional, spiritual, and physical. Tell us what you do and, and make sure they know how they can contact you. Ladies and gentlemen, um, so many people say that Plan for Fitness is broad in the spectrum of services I provide, I'm a health and wellness uh, practitioner, and what I love to do is being involved with community outreach, helping the less fortunate, um, reaching out to disabled people. There are uh, some families that are out of state and their loved ones are in a nursing home. I urge you to contact family members, friends, or even plan for fitness to do a nursing home visit on your loved one. Um, I have visited many, many homes in the area, and I, I don't have much comment about it except for I would certainly be very selective where you place your loved one. 
It's a 24-hour care facility, and uh, currently I have a client of mine of eight years in a facility right now. He had cardiac issues, and it's been uh, on hemodialysis. It's been very complex. If I were not following up, uh, my friends, it would be a different situation for Mr. Hess. And you will be hearing from Mr. Hess on the next show. I will interview him again, and, and he's on, on the road to recovery, but it's been a great challenge. So, Sharonda, you know, Plan for Fitness is very involved in many aspects of the health and wellness field, uh, available for um, organizational um, and home sanitization services. Somebody may not be able to be living in a healthy home. They may need help. They may not have friends or family that care. These are services that I provide. So I, my contact information is, the website is www.planforfitnessradio.com. And the talk show line number is 561-856-0100. 561-856-0100. Sharonda, I want to thank you. I want to thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you so much. Ladies and gentlemen, it was a pleasure to have Sharonda McGee here on the Plan for Fitness talk show and on the World Beat with host and producer Helen Daphne. We'll be right back after these messages.